G'day my YouTube friends, how's everyone going? My name's Caroline and this is my weekly wrap up. All right, I hope wherever you are, you're having a happy Sunday. I'm filming this pretty early in the morning because I am going out for the rest of the day. So I don't have my Pepsi cheese. Instead, I've just got some water and I gave it a little spritz in the soda stream. So happy soda stream water. Cheers to you. <laughs> All right. So this is probably going to be a pretty short and sweet um, wrap up. I have only really done spending out of two envelopes this week. I finally got my new cover. I can't show you because I'm filming with that phone right now. So I'm going to insert a picture right now. It's from this company Casetify and it's a really great company. All their cases are made from recycled phone cases and it's just, it's good for the environment. You are paying for the name. Just like if you were to buy an Apple iPhone, you're paying a lot more because of the name but you also get a very good decent quality product and the cases are no different they're very great they take if you drop your phone they absorb a lot of the the fall and they don't break as easy but they're not like if you're shopping for phone cases from like Kmart for ten dollars there is a difference not just in price but in quality as well and I wanted to splurge because a friend of mine also got one and they've just got beautiful beautiful designs or you can actually even make your own as well you can like upload I think a photo or or something like that I'm pretty sure I don't know I didn't do that I got the beautiful plants because you know me I love my plants so that's that and that was a hundred dollars it was just a little bit over a hundred but you know, I had, I've just taken the rest out of my buffer. So I just have to take out of splurge. I need to take out $100. So we'll take out oh, 20, 40, 60, 81. We'll take out all the 20s, which will leave us with 1, 2, 3, 4, 55, 50. All right. So it'll be the 9th, 10th minus 100 and 550 will remain. So yeah, I really wanted to do that. I really wanted to get, I was hoping it would be here in time of me buying the phone and I didn't have to buy the other one, uh, which was the clear phone cover that I showed you guys, but it didn't get here in time. So, but that's okay. These things happen. And then the other thing I have to go to is head to toe because I actually went online and I purchased where I get like hair laser removal done. They were having a 50% off sale. So I was able to buy a bundle and it was $90, sorry. So I had to take out 50, 70, 90, which will leave me with one, two, 53, 50, 70, 90, four, 10. And then I still have to get a haircut. I still have to buy probably some face cream this week. So next week, I imagine more money will be taken out as well. Um, I knew once I reached this goal that it wouldn't stay at $500 for long, but that's okay. This is why we do this system. This is why we have this money in here. So it's able to be there when it's needing to be spent. So we have 20, 40, 60, 81. 190 brilliant so that will go back to cover my spending from my card all right so now that i've taken that money out and that will be put back into the bank um i want to end this video on some tv show that i watched this week so i did start for those who have asked have i watched the hocus pocus movie yet i did and I didn't even finish it. I got about halfway through and I and I don't normally do this. I like to f see a movie through, uh, but yeah, I had to switch it off. I really wasn't enjoying it. I just felt it was very gimmicky. Nothing like the original, you know, 90s movies were a time where movies were made just differently. And that original classic Hocus Pocus is a classic. There, it, it, this new one, it just felt like a live action movie or something to me. And I know there was that one song in the original, but it wasn't, didn't feel, I don't know. I just, I didn't like it. So sorry if those out there did, I'm really happy for you. But I just, yeah, I didn't feel it at all. Uh, so I switched that off and then I ended up going on to Netflix and there was a new period drama that's been released. So for those who like period dramas, 
give the Empress a go. It's a really great show. So I think it's got like six or eight episodes. I can't remember, um, but I smashed them out this week. And it's normally an, a, a foreign TV show. So if you don't like watching, it's dubbed with an English voiceover, but I don't like watching shows that way because I end up concentrating on their lips too much. <laughs> so what I did is I switched that off. I made it into its original language, which is German. And I also like that because you get to hear the real actors' voices and stuff. And then what I did is, because I don't obviously speak or understand German, I put on English subtitles. And that's just how I like to watch foreign films personally like I watched Squid Game the same way I didn't have the English voiceover I just listened to it in Korean and just read the English um, and I really enjoyed it she's kind of gives me Elizabeth Bennet vibes with the whole sass and knows what she wants um, and you know it's just a really sweet little love story but spoiler free but I will give you the heads up that it does end like that so i'm hoping there is going to be a season two i did try to look online after i finished watching you know just in case i didn't want to get spoilers um and there's nothing that's been revealed yet that there is going to be a part two so hopefully there will be because yeah it's leaves you wanting more that's for sure but that was a great 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 show i really enjoyed it so if you're into period dramas traditional period dramas not like bridgerton this is a very traditional bridge uh period drama where it's serious um definitely give it a go because it was fun i really really enjoyed it but yeah anyway that's it i told you this video is going to be pretty short and sweet uh so water cheers to you guys i hope wherever you are you're having a happy sunday i look forward to doing my weekly cash stuffing with you guys tomorrow uh so until then Take care. Bye for now. Bye. Bye.